We can't see them, but we count on them to be there when we need them the most. They would have saved the life of 18-year-old Bobby Ellsworth, the front seat passenger in this crash. But the airbags that should have deployed and protected were not there. The parents of Bobby Ellsworth wanted justice, and they asked attorney Julia Haas to help them. I asked them, well, what do you want me to do about it? And they told me, we don't want this happening again to anyone. And I didn't know anything about this area, but I told them I would do my absolute best to make sure that it didn't happen to anyone else. Oz found out that the truck, driven by Bobby's best friend, had an ugly hidden history. It had been in a previous wreck, one that had totaled the truck. The salvage was sold at auction to auto body repair shop owner Arnold Parra. Arnold Parra took this vehicle and just brought it back to his shop. He saw that the airbags were deployed. He didn't want to put the money into it to have it fixed. On the airbag, on the driver's side, he cut out the airbag stuffed paper in that area, glued the cover on, and then painted it so it didn't look like anything had happened to it. On the passenger side, where Bobby Ellsworth was, he just cut out the airbag and glued it shut. And if you just look at the airbags, you're not able to see that there's anything wrong with it. A deadly deceit that cost the Ellsworths their son. Courtroom victory was only part of the way Julia Haas kept her promise not to let it happen to anyone else. The more I learned about it, the more I found how systemic it was. It didn't, it wasn't just this dealer, it wasn't just, you know, this unsuspecting person that was buying the vehicle. This is happening all the time. Thanks in part to her efforts on this case, a national database detailing the accident history of every vehicle is now public for anyone to search. It's justice and peace of mind that the loss suffered by your clients never has to happen again.